a bit of testing here on the ATU-10. So we've got 17 feet of coax. We have a 17 foot counterpoise, nine to one with a 31 foot radiator sloping down. And if we look at 20 meter band, SWR on the T1, obviously not happy. So let's try to make a match. So we'll plug in the ATU-10, out, in. That's just a common mode choke jumper here. All right, so we'll see, we'll give it a tone and it should start tuning. And we've got a three over a three, which obviously is not great. We'll do a reset here. Give it another shot. Still not happy over a three. Um, let's power it off, power it back on. I think I've seen somebody had luck with that. Power off. Power back on. Right. So it's seen about two watts coming in, still can't make a match, about a three. So what I'm gonna do is put the Ellicraft T1, allow it to tune, show that we can tune this. And uh, then we'll put the ATU-10 in line and see what it reads for that. But uh, Antenna, transceiver. Set that up to tune. Tune. Oh, okay, so I made a match earlier with it, so it's not even trying to tune. Because it's already happy at a one-to-one. -one. Um, let me just switch bands here. We'll let it tune. We'll switch back to 20. 20 meter, and we'll let it tune again. All right, so you can see it was happy. TX500 is now happy. No problem there. Real happy. Okay. So we've got a good match through the T1. I'm gonna put the ATU-10 in line and we'll just see what it's reading. Hopefully that'll tell us if it's metering SWR properly. So antenna, we'll jumper from the and that's out, in. All right, so we'll see. So again, we've got the TU, uh, excuse me, the T1 making a match. We've got the ATU 10, which we'll see what it's reading now. So it's still got the last reading on it. We'll give it a tone. We'll see what it starts showing. So one to one, you can see we're getting more power out because the radio is happy. Go ahead and put this into reset or bypass mode. And it doesn't try to tune. Actually, now it's not showing an SWR reading, but it is showing power. I've not seen that before. We'll tell it to tune. Okay. So we told it to tune, now it is reading SWR. Reset. That's weird, when you send it to reset mode, it doesn't tell you SWR. I don't think I'd seen it do that before. Let's try it again, power it off, power back on. Okay, reset, interesting. So should not have any trouble tuning this. Nothing special about it. T1 is a great tuner, but the ATU seems to not be able to tune that match for some reason, and that doesn't, doesn't seem quite right. So I do believe there's something going on with it.